everybody, my name is Analytical Plum and welcome back to my channel. I'm going to try not to ramble on because we all know what's happening today. We are going to be continuing to watch The Bad Batch and we are now on episode 6 and 7. It is a double episode today and I am so excited to see what's going to be coming up next but before we begin reacting to the next couple of episodes i would appreciate if you would consider subscribing i do post twice a week but don't hold me to that and if you like my reaction videos or if you like star wars and the bad batch then i would appreciate if you would like this video and without further ado let's just jump straight into the next couple of bad batch episodes Enzo? What, what is that? Assassin's Creed? <laughs> tech, my boy! <laughs> right, I know, I know that's probably not tech, but it is for me, so... If you are new here, I'm a firm believer that tech's alive, right? It's a thing. They're not dead unless you see them die it's just a thing tech isn't dead that's tech at the moment in my mind although i don't know could be anyone at this point could be asage <laughs> cut <Cadbane? laughs> secretly anakin <laughs> i suppose vader at this point i'm approaching with the senator what's your status oh All clear up top. that's the senator from season two i believe that they saved oh i didn't expect him to come back up we're standing by copy that stay alert I'm not certain it was wise to come out of hiding, Senator. It is not safe for us here. We're not safe anywhere, GS8. You stole my line. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> what do I say now? What, what do I just sit here and look? Cool. Don't worry. My team is in position. Love your exe, boo. Oh. Sorry, we're late. I had to take a few extra precautions. Hello, Chi-Chi. Thank you for meeting with me. Right, I know I said already that this reminds me of Assassin's Creed, but it's kind of like Assassin's Creed mixed with Dishonored. Dishonored is one of my favourite games, if you didn't know. This is heavy Dishonored vibes. <laughs> Please, have a seat. I am sad. I'll... I must apologise for all the secrecy. I must say your request was unexpected, seeing as how our planets were on opposite sides during the Clone War. Ah, you know... Let bygones be bygones. That was ages ago now. I believe we are now united in wanting the same things. Premix. The Separatist Senate may not exist any longer, but our desire for true independence has not faded. There are whispers the Emperor is concerned that planets and systems may unite and oppose him. Well, I don't know who would think of doing that. No way. With no unifying leaders on our side, we're at a disadvantage. But the Emperor needs to be cautious. He cannot just strike out at us openly. Such limitations haven't stopped them from occupying planets. But I will do anything for my people. What are you suggesting? Well, I mean, you can try and seduce Papa Pouts and... I don't know, rob him, throw him in the bin. As you can see, I am probably not the minds in this operation. <laughs> see, this would be me and Dishonoured. Oh. Good night. Greer. Greer, come in. He's having a bit of a nap at the moment. Donnie was just trying to make a sandwich in the kitchen, you know, a little midnight snack, and he's just getting bombed. Poor dude. New Zealand's going underground. We're in pursuit. He's heading for the southern maintenance tower. On it. Oh. Well, it's not tech, but I mean, it's still a clone, so... It wasn't that far off. I got him. It's one of those shadows we keep running into. Oh, they proper creep me out. 
We secured the assassin, but I'd advise you and Singh to keep a lower profile until we know more. Understood. Thank you, Rex. Thank you, Rex. You're my boy. You think you'll cooperate? No. I wouldn't count on it. We recovered this from his gear. It's a data puck. Highly encrypted. Have Fireball find out what's on it when we get back to base camp. Fireball can break the firewall in the puck. I'm hoping they got out that, you know, self-offing device that's in their mouth. Otherwise, they're not going to get much out of him. I hope they have. In that, um, Teth from Clone Wars, I believe, possibly the movie. I think it was that. No idea. <laughs> Little flick to the head. Did you extract the device? The electro capsule was implanted in one of his teeth, just like you said. His identifying number's been wiped too. And his teeth? Well, that's a root canal that you don't want. I didn't think it was in his teeth. Although I suppose it makes a lot of sense now. What exactly did the Empire do to him? What didn't they do? What's your name, Trooper? No matter what they did to you, no matter what you've done. You're still a clone. You're still one of us. One I of us. Help you. Why have I been activated? One of the other operatives has gone dark. His internal humming device remains intact, so we know he's alive. Track him down and neutralize him. Right. I know I've been wrong in the past. But tech? No, right, please don't get annoyed at me. I'm just I'm very passionate. You know, you can't fault the passion. <laughs> I think he's that small and all. Perfect height. Where are you based? Coruscant? Tantis? Oh yeah, we know about Tantis. And the clones imprisoned there. Were you one of them? At least a sniffle. You know, give us a sneeze. It's more than nothing. His data puck was a target register. Who was he after? Senator Singh. But that wasn't the only person on his list. Omega! No. Contact Echo and Hunter. We need to let them know. That can't be good. We should bring them here. I, I don't want to involve them in this. Crosshair is with them. This is our chance to question him. He knows more than he's saying. <laughs> I mean, I understand, but I mean, please. Just like, give him time to breathe. I'm too soft for this line of work. I'd probably cry if you just sneezed on me. I don't know why I'm very snotty today. Oh no, Amiga is so cute. She's trying to be like Crosshair. Oh no, don't. I love their relationship they've got going on. It's so adorable. Where exactly are we headed? It's a base. Of sorts. I thought your rendezvous with Gregor was top priority. I'll pick him up after dropping you lot off. Gregor! I don't look happy to see us. Just like old times, huh? <laughs> oh, I love it. Good to see you, Rex. Wish I felt the same. I have unfinished business with this one. Come on now. Remember me? Surprised I'm alive? Most of my squad from Ryloth is dead because of you. Well, well now things make perfect sense. I really don't fault you now. I'll just keep my mouth shut because obviously that's the best thing for me. <laughs> Omega! I was planning on giving you this after I made a few more modifications, but uh, now's as good a time as any. Oh no, is that her crossbow? She had a crossbow in the promotional posters, and I was wondering what was going to happen with that. Is this it? I hope so. I'm so excited about seeing a laser crossbow thing. An energy crossbow? Where did you get it? I've made a few interesting contacts across the galaxy. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, that's so cool. Thank you, Echo. Well, that's certainly small and discreet. <laughs> Your numbers are growing. Well, we need all the help we can get. Once we find the exact coordinates of the Tantus space, we have to hit it hard if we're going to pull our brothers out of there. Hoping it all goes well. Because imagine that, then they'll just get more clones. 
to experiment on. We recovered a target list from an Imperial operative. Omega's on it. Not a surprise. She escaped Imperial custody. So did you. Guess I'm not as valuable to them. Oh, but you're valuable to me. And that's what matters. Or you're feeding them information. You're gonna have to back down, Captain. You expect us to believe he was held on Tantus for months, but he doesn't know how to get back there? He was just a prisoner. Your squad may trust you, but I don't. What's going on? The Empire's targeting you. Why were they after you before? Because she's amazing. Why else? To force Nalise to cooperate and conduct certain experiments. She was working on something involving M Count? M Count? You know what that is? Well, I've heard it mentioned before, but I can't say ah! for sure. No, oh, you know, you know, Rex, you know. Just think about it. Just please. There's more you should know. Not all of the clones on Tantus are prisoners. There is a division of clones trained as specialized operatives and initiated into a secret deep cover program run by Hemlock. <coughs> Tech. Their identities are erased. They undergo conditioning. If the program's so secretive, how do you know about it? Because they tried to make me into one of them. It didn't work. Thank God. Being defective is in my nature. Right, but you see, right, so Tech was on the verge of dying or he was severely injured. So, right, listen, Hemlock was able to condition him because he was vulnerable because, you know, he literally fell off a track in the air, so. You've encountered one before. The assassin on Coruscant. We captured one. I've tried questioning him, but he hasn't been very cooperative. You have one here? Alive? We scanned him. He's clear. It's not the kind of tracker your scans would pick up. Well, say goodbye to your base now because it is not lasting long at all. Don't forget your personal items, okay? We won't be here long. You can have mine. <laughs> Can't they just wrap her in bubble wrap? Just keep her like safe in a bunch of bubble wrap. I have a visual on Dr. Hemlock's prime target. She's with a group of rogue clowns. Send the coordinates and prepare for the recovery strike team. The girl must be taken alive. Well, at least they said alive. We need to leave now. If you want answers so badly, why aren't you asking him? The trying. Right, brother. Ugh, you freaked me out. Oh. He's lying. <laughs> oh no, don't. <laughs> we move out now. Please, just throw him out the window. He's creepy. <laughs> Rex! <laughs> See, that's what you need more of. No way the assassin's dead. No way. We've lost contact with the operative. Prepare to land and set blasters to stun. Our orders are to retrieve the target alive. Wolfie. Mate, what are you doing? You just lost. I can fix him. <laughs> you're like a cockroach. But if it's tech, then it's fine. Still, you're a cockroach. We need to get moving before the reinforcements get here. Is there another way off this spire? <laughs> There's always another way. At least someone came prepared. Our leech vessel's docked about ten levels down. Doesn't have a hyperdrive, though. We won't get far. No, but we can use it to contact Echo. It's never that easy, is it? Never that simple. <sighs> can I just watch one episode without wanting to just cry or scream or any of the above? These are clones. They're not insurgents. They are both. What squadron are you with? 
That's classified. Want to tell me why this spire is burning when our primary objective is to retrieve the target unharmed? Yeah, I mean, to be fair, that wasn't entirely his fault, but he did also have a handful of bombs in his pockets, so... I can't defend you much here, mate. They're escaping through the middle of the spire. Oh, come on, guys. Sloppy work. You got to cover your tracks. Set charges and seal this passage. We'll pin them inside. F has been absolutely wrecked. But I mean, I'm not exactly surprised. Who else is surprised? Not me. <laughs> Was that a hint? You know, because, I mean, that's how Tech was when he died. I'm just saying. They're coming. I'll handle it. Are you sure? You're a bit shaky at the moment. I'm, I'm not sure. Well, hopefully that's not where they want to go. We need to go. Don't worry, she only bites half of the time. Great. <laughs> Reassuring. Prepare to launch. Oh, just take a breather, man. From R1, we've been compromised. Surely they, they should have a hobby or something. You know, just <laughs> leave them alone. We're going down. Strap in. That's really Ten making sure crash, that she's right? alive, yes, isn't it? I said to use stun blasts only. You've jeopardized this mission. Our orders are to retrieve the girl alive and unharmed. You gotta punish him now. No ifs or buts. Crush him like a cockroach that he is. You good. Uh-huh. Got your crossbow. Yep. Sure you can carry those supplies. Yes. <laughs> Stay close. You're as bad as Hunter. Oh, I'm much worse. Oh no, I just I think putting them two together is just the best idea anyone's ever come up with. I just think they're so amazing together. We'll have to continue on foot. How far? Five clicks north. Click. <laughs> I've seen how you are with the kid. You're different than you were on Ryloth. What changed? He got a bit zapped. In each shoulder, in each toe, each side of his head, you know, it kind of rattled his brain a bit. I hear it too. Turn into Michael Jackson. Just leave me alone. I compensate for all the eardrums I've broke tonight. Oh, that's such a good team. He's still got his accuracy. Guys. Omega smoke grenade. We're out. It's not looking good, bro. I'll draw his fire. Get to the rendezvous. I don't like that idea. Too bad. <laughs> This is basically what it's like to play Fortnite. I don't know what it's like with the new update, but it's just, <laughs> especially in solos or when you're down at the end of duos, it's just a sniper game and this is it. <laughs> it's not swimming time, guys. It just don't stop going. Now we're recreating The Last of Us. Oh my god. You chose the wrong side. Tech, relax, man. <laughs> Don't you dare. No. No. Oh, thank god. He's not dead. Shut up. <laughs> I 
I thought you were dead. Stop it. Port said you were killed in action. That you went down aboard an attack cruiser. Oh, I did. Don't tell me you're fighting against us. No, not against you. Yeah, so stop being a little bitch and join Rex. I think that's a good plan. They're imprisoning and experimenting on our brothers. The Empire wouldn't do that to us. She has seen it. Well, more importantly, Crosshair has been through it. That's what's happening on Tentus. I am a soldier of the Empire. You're a disappointment. I have my orders. I know you've been trained not to question orders, but open your eyes. You're hunting a child. Saying that though, children can be actual menaces. I'm really into true crime, right? Some of the stuff they do is absolutely horrific. I'm asking you to do the right thing. Please tell me that's Echo. Gregor! All of the rebels lads are coming together! <laughs> See, it's kind of funny knowing what's going to happen, but also not because it's these parts where it's just like, Arr, come on! Commander, stand down. You, you, let them, you let them go? I would kiss your forehead if you were real. Recover their fallen, then we move out. But, sir, uh, they're traitors. Perhaps. But they're clones. I knew it! Come on, let me see that beautiful receding headline of yours, Tech. Oh, okay. Fine. You know, I thought that the end of the war would mean an end to losing more of our brothers. I was wrong. We'll protect her. I heard what Omega said about her escape. I think she's vital to whatever they're doing on Tentus. But she's more sensitive. You need to find out why she's so important to them. Ah! Don't! Oh, fully, I think that it just it keeps getting better and better. And I, I, I can't decide which one is my favourite and I, I don't suppose, I don't have to decide. All of them are really really good, obviously there are a few that I really really like but they're all just incredible and I got a comment, literally I read it this morning and it was saying about how this has been the most intense Star Wars we've had in a while and I definitely agree, it's, it's Star Wars you know, it's coming back and I just, I, I'm in love, it's been so good and hopefully we're gonna see Amiga and her force sensitivity soon. I'm hoping, I'm hoping, because I know in my heart she is, and there's no way we're getting all these double episodes if they're not gonna have some reveals. So I'm hoping, I'm keeping my fingers crossed for some of those reveals. Thank you so much for sticking around and for watching my video. Let me know if you enjoyed these two episodes and I will see you all in the next video.